Hello, welcome back. Maths Cooks. It's Monday. That must mean it's Maths Monday. Uh, that can mean one of two things on the channel. Uh, sometimes I do tips and tricks videos on a Monday. Sometimes I do uh, more sort of, uh, not rambly, but um, talking about stuff that interests me that is to do with maths. And that is what today is. Um, I was listening to a podcast last week with somebody called Mona Chalabi. And I've not heard of her before, but she's a well-known data journalist. So uh, she was really interesting. So I went and had a look at some of her work and it's really, really good. So I wanted to share that with you. So Mona Chalabi, she does these really, really engaging, interesting, powerful infographics. Um, and they're really accessible. And what I really love about them is they, they are hand, well, they, say, they certainly look hand-drawn and they make you think, ah, I could do that. And that's a really great thing. And it just makes you think, I don't have to do dull, boring bar charts. I could convey that same information in, in a much more interesting way. The infographics often are dealing with quite difficult topic matter. She deals with race uh, and politics, all kinds of things like that. Um, and, and they're all the more powerful for that. Um, so, get I, obviously, I'll, I'll be putting some up on the screen, but get over on Instagram and have a look at those. But perhaps the, but perhaps the most important, hang on, uh, perhaps the most important sort of takeaway from this, if you like, is to have a think about how you could use that in your work. Because I'm sure in your school work, or if you're an adult in a world of work, um, you're asked to do that sort of thing sometimes, aren't you? Bar charts and pie charts and that kind of thing. And I think there might be a time, well, certainly I always found them a bit dull. Oh, the bar chart again. Um, but take, take inspiration from Mona Chalabi and think about how could I make this more interesting? How could I make this really engage somebody to want to look at this and to think about it? Um, because that's the aim really, isn't it? That's, that's what we're after with a good, when we're trying to get across um, these concepts when we're dealing with infographics and displaying data that's really what we're trying to do isn't it uh, and she does it brilliantly so I'd urge you to check out her work okay well thank you very much for watching this week if you're subscribed already thank you very much indeed it's good to have you on board if you aren't do consider doing so it's obviously free um, it just helps the channel out a lot or give a little thumbs up below or join in the conversation leave your comments below um, I'll respond to all of them um, I appreciate you being here. Thank you very, very much. I shall see you either next week for another Maths Monday or on Thursday for uh, a kind of GCSE lesson or on Sundays at five o'clock on Facebook Live. That's Maths Kitchen um, for help with your homework. See you next week. Bye-bye.